This past week, ranchers gathered in Miles City for the Montana Stock Growers Association mid-year meeting. The Montana Ag Network's Lane Norland shares how ranchers were entertained and inspired by a country music singer who got his start growing up on a ranch. Oh, me. With 10 number one hits, 40 top 10 hits, and 66 chart hits, along with songs that have embodied the American cowboy, Mo Bandy can trace it all back to growing up on a ranch near San Antonio, Texas. I was raised on the ranch, riding horse, working cattle, doing all the stuff that we that you do, build fences. And uh, so I've been around it all my life. My whole family is, loves the sport of rodeo. And my dad had Bandy's Arena. We had bull riding there. And my younger brother, Mike, went to the final seven times in bull riding. And uh, so we all started. I, I rode bulls and bareback horses some, but I uh, had a big old oak tree out there, and I set up my little band, and I'd play. And As the nation's farmers and ranchers continue to experience a depressed ag economy, Mo Bandy wants to bring joy to the men and women who feed the world. The minute I found out that we were doing this, uh, I, I was excited because raised around cattle, raised around uh, livestock, and, and uh, the cowboys and cowgirls are my, my friends. And so it's my kind of deal. It just falls right into what I do. I love to entertain. I love to... Uh, music uh, can make people get out of their troubles sometimes and, and concentrate in a different area. And so I love it. And, and tonight when we do our show, uh, I'll just be in front of my, my people and I hope that whatever problems, and I know that's a rough time right now. And by the way, I've sat on one of them John Deere tractors for many hours, so I know what they're doing. Uh, and I hope we can make them happy. For aspiring country singers, Mo Bandy had this advice. Just when you're about ready to give up, hang in there because usually that's when something's going to happen and you just got to stay at it you got to get to Nashville or nowadays you just practically got to get in there and stay with it believe in yourself write songs writing is very good uh, and, and learn instruments these kids now they play every instrument on the stage but uh, and believe in yourself you know that's almost the same message you get out for farmers and ranchers exactly same thing uh, you know, a lot of times when you're having troubles and your crops are not coming in right and everything, and you just don't know what to do, a lot of times it'll turn around, hopefully. Even after being on the road for decades, entertaining the masses day in and day out, Mo Bandy truly appreciates and understands the important role farmers and ranchers play here in Montana and across the nation. In Miles City, Lane Nordlund, MTN News. Well, the Mo Bandy concert was one of many events held to celebrate the Montana Stock Growers Association formation, which took place in Miles City 135 years Listen, ago. That is the cowboy town, too, it, by yeah. the way. That's uh, Lonesome Dove, the history of Miles City, Mo Bandy, too, a great artist. Pretty great. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah.